1947, near the top secret air base at Roswell, New Mexico, the United States military finally got a... Meet Desmond Sodder, a man who spends his evenings in front of the television, defeated by a mundane lifestyle, and the incessant unsatisfaction of his girlfriend, the reprehensible yet surprisingly alluring Brandy Tartmouth. Are we going to just sit here all night? Sure. Or so Desmond thinks. For this evening, his inner monologue will not be his own, and the voices that he hears will not be of this earth, which I'm sure we'll all find quite confusing. For Desmond has taken permanent residence in the shoddy living room. You know, I used to think it was cool dating an older guy. But now you're just old. Why is she so yelly at me all the time? Buying beer for my friends? Cool. Making sure I don't puke in my hair? Awesome. But f dude, all you do is sit in that chair! What's wrong with this chair? Nothing's wrong with the chair, Desmond. There's something wrong with the girl. She should just whip out her jugs and shut up. Are you listening to me? She just wants to sit in the chair. Next thing you know, she'll want to hold the remote. Over here, you ignorant f You can't let her talk to you like that. Who does she think she is? Kill her, Desmond. Make her pay. Squeeze her melons. I want ice cream. What's wrong with you, Des? Why won't you listen to me? End her life, Desmond. Release her from this tainted world. You know, kill her. There's a knife under the chair. Stick it to her. Put it in her. What am I doing? Des, buddy. What gives? You can't let a woman treat you this way. It's a slap in the face to men all over the country, all over the world. Um, there's a problem here. I was looking for, um, Desmond Sada, and all I see is a puss! Yeah, Doc. It's clearly bitch season. That fur is an unlithicated fabrication. It's actually wabbit season. Bitch season. Wabbit season! Bitch season. Wabbit season! What? Are you gonna stab me or something? I'm gonna kill you! Whoa, oh, oh, Des, buddy! Chill! I'm Daniel Bissell. I do voices. You know the thing that I just realized is stormtroopers are very similar to the Republican Party. They're all white and they carry guns. Number one, bring Magneto to the bridge and tell him Patty Stew is waiting. I'm a love, Desmond. <laughs> do you think your average stormtrooper has to take off his entire armor just to lay a brick? Are you from outer space? Because your breasts are out of this world. <laughs> All right. Giggity, giggity, giggity. That's precious. Sneaker never hurt the master. Tonight, Desmond Sauter learned a valuable lesson. Never listen to the voices inside your head. Unless you're an airline pilot or a member of the Secret Service. A member of the Secret Service who just signed a six-month lease. A resident of the shoddy living room. Who's your friend?